Hey YouTube, it's Mitch at iPhoneCaptain.com. Today we're going to be looking at a software called iSkySoft iPhone Data Recovery for your iOS device. And I will have download links for Windows and Mac users in the description below. What this software does, it allows you to, uh, if your device gets stuck in recovery mode or some, or some other type of mode, you know, all you need to do is plug it up, click recovery, and it will then it will go back, kick it back into the correct running software on your device is what I'm trying to spit out. And if you have a problem with your iOS, it can even fix that. So let's talk a little bit more about what all this does in a little more detail. Go here. It says recover from my recover from iOS device, and I'm simply going to restart and it's already connecting to my device and my device just right then it kicked it back out of recovery mode okay so that's one of the great things about it if you get if you're one of those people that's scared of getting in recovery mode or your iOS seems to not be functioning properly it will allow you to download the most recent iOS and fix all that right from inside this firmware Plus, you can just go up here on this first block, hit recover your iOS device, and it will reboot your device in, into the uh, correct running mode. And then from there, uh, there's several things you can do. You can recover any kind of uh, iTunes backup you might have or some type of file you might want to open up in there. You can do that inside of of this and you see here it's 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 actually working it opened iCloud and as you can see it's opened up some of my pictures you can recover pictures you can do all sorts of things using this brilliant software once you hit the recover key here you can it's going to do a scan and if you wanted to just maybe find certain things like photos or Maybe you were looking for a video that you had lost on your device. You could go ahead and just hit the, I'm going to go ahead and hit the stop key and no relevant data found and hit OK. And right here you can see you can check off devices connected and you can select the type of data that you want to recover. So if you don't want to recover any of these items, which I'm not wanting to recover any of that right now, I'm simply just looking for photos right now just so it goes a little bit faster uh, we're not even gonna leave out videos or anything like that in there so thumbnails no let's go ahead and hit start and as you can see it goes much faster and it will actually download all of my photos directly into the software and then I can skim through and find the actual soft the uh, photo I'm looking for and maybe it's an important photo that, of some loved one that you didn't want to delete. Uh, and it just does a fantastic job. And this is one thing on here that I think is just remarkable. That you can go back in time and actually find things on your phone. Okay, just to walk you through a little bit what I've done here. I have created a note on my iPhone 6 called Test. And another one called Wondershare. And I'm going to scan my iOS device and see if it can find the one I deleted, which was the one marked test. And it should have been the most recent one I just created today. So we'll see how many notes it finds and if it can go back and find the one marked notes. So we will come back when it completes its scan. As you can see here, it did find the one labeled test, which was created 614 at 1258. And as you can see by the date, it is June 14th, and it's around 1 o'clock here. So that was the one that I created and deleted just a few moments ago. And you can see it found 69 different notes. And if we wanted to put this back, we could just select it and hit Recover. And we want to recover it to the device. And currently it says it can only support Recover Message Contacts to your device would you like to continue okay and it says no data found recovered to device so let's go to notes and 
we have to find test again here which I have selected right here and as you can see I just had marked in there and, and recovered to, to device now and it says it has recovered all the selected notes to device voila and now it is completely recovered and I can now find it back on my device which is remarkable 